What's up YouTube, this is Unicorn Attack for Total Wild and I'm bringing you here a 1 vs 1 Flash Tournament The Beta Call Tournament 16, Fall the Samurai vs Fall the Samurai This is the final, the first game, I'm playing on the map Aki Over on the right side I have Killer Fissioner, on the left side we have Prussian Prince uh, Let's see the army composition of Prussian Prince real quick and let's go to slow motion they have, He has a Red Bay Infantry, 1, 2, 3 of them, all with 2 upgrades, then a his general, which is a mixer of a moral and a gun gen. Then he has a revolver cavalry. His cavalry contingent is 1, 2, 3, 4 Yeriki, level 6, highly upgraded in mean, melee attack. Then a black tutor's force, or another red bear that makes 4, 5 red bear in total, and a white bear infantry over on the right side. He doesn't have any. Whoa, another revolver cap popped up, so two revolver cap. Down for killer fish we have Yeri Key level 7, another Yeri Key level 7, then another Yeri Key level 7, so four Yeri Key all level 7, then two Imperial Guard cavalry, a Saber Calf level 4, and a Shogitai hidden in the forest, then backed up by another Shogunate Guard infantry, cavalry, sorry, level 2, and his general, which is a gun, is immoral. That is a Bushido Gen with a gun enabled. Then over on the right side he has a Million Bird Force and another show time. So over here there is already there's a calf fight uh, going on over on the hill. Let's see who has the charge bonus. Over here uh, it's the Yeri Key of Prussian Prince which has the charge bonus I think. Over on the center he's Yeri Key charged into two Yeri Key Prussian Prince, so I don't know who should want that. Oh! And this gunfire of the Shogun Guard Cavalry is uh, routing his own cavalry, but they over here the Revolver Cav can pwned by these Imperial Guard Cavalry, and already there's some fire by Prussian Prince into these uh, cavalry from Fish. Very hectic battle over here. We have the cavalry, uh, the Imperial Guard Cav are almost in the combat with the general, so Prussian Prince is moving them back. To the safety of his guns. These Imperial Guard Cavs still alive at 52 men. But over the center, the cavalry of Prussian Elf uh, Fish is totally gone. It's gone. Uh, over here, he has a Saber Cav which is capturing the Sword Dojo, but at this stage, uh, Killer Fish can't really do much anymore. Um, he's sending his cavalry right in the center, trying to hold up this Red Bay infantry. But over here, there's another second line of Prussian Prince firing into the East cavalry. Uh, the Shogun Guard Cavalry are at 12 men, already wavering, only killed 2 men. Over here the Imperial Guard Cavalry uh, killed 77 men, but they are attacked by some Yeriki. Over here the Yeriki is charging into the General of Killerfish. Um, yeah, this is almost game, I think. Uh, Killerfish is trying to send his Shogitai into uh, the line, but it really has to get some uh, miracle happen if Killerfish wants to win this. Uh, over here the uh, Vermilion Bird Force is standing to fire, but all these lines of Prussian Prince, I don't know. Uh, this is Shogitai coming right now, charging into these Red Bear, but these Red Bear are retreating. And that's, I think, Killerfish ended the game. So that's the first win for uh, Prussian Prince, very quick match, a good game by both players. Um, I think just Prince had the uh, better uh, army composition for this map. Uh, Killerfish was on the straight up rush, rush but uh, Prince was just in time to react on that and he counter charged him so the cavalry couldn't go anywhere and then his guns could shot, uh, could just shoot the cav. Uh, and yeah, that's it. So let's see the deployment. Yeah, Prussian Prince killed 1500 men, 1440 men, so almost 1500 killerfish, almost 1960. So you really see here the the difference and enemies killed, they only killed 405 Prussian Prince and Killerfish, amazingly 368. Unit statistics we have Yeri Key 61 Prussian Prince and Revolver Cav 56. So they all did okay, all pretty fair amount of kills. Then the Killerfish is Imperial Guard Cavalry 85, which is a vanilla one. Yeri Key 57, but the army composition of Killerfish, he was just too small to do anything. So I will see you all. But the brackets. Alright, so over here we have the brackets. Uh, I will not spoil the results just yet. You might have seen the live streams. Uh, Discars live streamed all the games uh, with casting by Zarut, Prussian Prince, and 
I will put the uh, description box, uh, the link to the channel of this cars uh, right over here and it when the, uh, his games are also uploaded. So over here we have um, Christian Prince, uh, he kills first Imperial Jules, then he kills from the Aran clan Killer Pancake. After that, uh, Bulgarian Soldier, uh, Twig, and now he has to fight Killerfish, and it's a 1 0 for uh, Christian Prince, it's the best out of 3. So Killerfish, he first won from Zrogram, good player, then he won from Paisa, a very good game, you really should watch the, uh, um, the, what was it, the, the, the stream, it's really good, uh, I think uh, this card already uploaded this game, a really close game. Um, then he won from us, boss, also a very close game, really close game. Uh, and now uh, it's, he is left behind one point, so let's see how we will do in round 2 of the Beta Call Tournament. 16. So here we are for game 2, we're playing on the map Alpine Ridge, it's 1-0 in the series for Prussian Prince in the final. Um, let's first go over to the armor composition of Killerfish right now. He has a Revolver Cavalry, a Yeriki, a Yeriki, and a Saber Cav. Yeriki all level 7 again, Revolver Cav, Vanilla and a Saber Cav level 2. Then a White Bear Infantry with Two spear levy and his general, which is the same. Then a Yeri key level seven, two more, and another saber cap level two, and a revolver cap again with just vanilla and a bird for vanilla. Over here he has a Yuk Itai, which just shown, uh, just came out of hiding. So shame, shame, shamefully enough. Let's pause it for real quick. We have Prussian Prince, his army, Black Tutor's Force, Black Tutor's Force, Black Tutor, Red Bear, and uh, Red Bear in front line, then in second line, a United States Marines 150 range, Royal Marine 150 range, and a Sherman Garden Infantry 150 range, level 9. Very expensive unit. Then a Red Bear and a White Bear in just reserve, then a Bo Boki, a 2 Boki is general. Which is the same, and he had he hides two black tutors for So just uh, as far as I can see, just a line uh, heavy build. Uh, we're playing on the Alpine Ridge, a sword dojo from this side, and on the other side with the farmhouse. Ooh, these uh, Yuki Tai will get trashed over here by these two black tutors for Although he has some cover by the cavalry, Yuki Tai are cutting away, retreating. Oh, they might fall for it. Let's see. Oh shit. Yeah, this will this will kill us some cavalry, I think. No, he's pulling away. Yeah, nice nice shot. Already killed 26 out of these uh, revolver cavalry. Good job over here. The general is in. Oh, the general will get caught by the Yeri Key. The general of Prussian Prince will get caught by the Yeri Key. Oh, that's a micro mistake. That's a big micro mistake by Prussian Prince over here. Um, oh, I don't know why Prussian Killerfish isn't going for the general. I don't know if he can call him. Uh, yeah, the general's gone for Prussian Prince, I think. 30 men only left, and he's retreating. Killerfish, that is. Uh, over here, the just Prussian Prince gave up two of his lines. That's all. That's also a bad mistake. And over here, again, two of his lines, Prussian Prince just went down. So that means that he already lost four out of his Black Tudor's forces. So that's a big loss for Prussian Prince and a good win for Killerfish with all his cavalry. Uh, over on the right side, uh, Prince is moving forward with his Royal Marine and his Shogunate Guard Infantry. They are both 150 range and trying to kill these Hungarian Bird Force and these Saber Cavalry. Uh, the Boki aren't doing anything at this moment. Uh, the Sword Dojo hasn't been captured by somebody yet. Oh, these Black Tutors Force are still alive. 70 no, now they are raped and routed. Um, yeah, he should really be aware of these Yuki Tai which are hiding in the forest and can still shoot while hitting. So, Prussian Prince is reacting okay, he's setting his United States Marine uh, over here in 150 range, they will easily kill these Yuki Tai. Over here there are some shots, the familiar bird force is shooting into the bow key of Prussian Prince, but this also allows the Royal Marines to get a volley off, and that will deal with this familiar bird force already down at 43 men. Uh, over on the left side for Prussian Prince, the Killerfish is already moving forward with his cavalry, so really have to be aware of that, si of that side, and he is really spreading his lines a lot. Uh, there are some gaps over here, so he should really be aware of Prussian Prince, that is. Um, the Saber Cap is almost in, is getting charged by a Boki, 
And also another Boki is shooting into the Saber Cap. I think the Saber Cap should win this, but nah. Killerfish tried to move forward with his say spear levy, but he just pulled off. Um, the general of Prussian Prince is still alive. Uh, this Saber Cap is down, 28 men. Boki is, all, is wavering for Prussian Prince, but there comes a cavalry charge from the backside versus these Royal Marines, so he should really be aware of that Prussian Prince at this. And oh, there's some shots into the spear levy, and uh, Yeri Kiev Killerfish will get shot over here by the uh, Royal Marine. That's a micro mistake by Yeri, by Killerfish, a very big micro mistake. Over here, there's also some fire going on. The Sherman Guard uh, infantry is shooting these million bird force. I don't know why they're way, uh, moving forward. And now they're standing still. There's a calf charge into the Royal Marines and a saber calf in the back. So I don't know if these Royal Marines will hold for long. Um, a good charge over here by Killerfish into these Royal Marines. Total, totally isolated. I don't know if they can stay. Oh, he pulls back the saber cavalry. I shouldn't have done that. Uh, the saber calf is now charging into the Shogun Garden Infantry, but the Shogun Garden Infantry is uh, just in time to get some shots into these units. Uh, at the moment is the right flank of Killerfish is totally exposed and he's pulling back and that's why Prussian Prince is moving forward with his units. The Royal Marines are almost gone, 46 men left. These uh, children garden infantry are shooting into these revolver cavalry, they are at 19 men. Oh, and there goes the Royal Marines, 108 kills. Also the children garden infantry will not hold for long I think. Although the cavalry contingent of uh, Killerfish is a bit wavering, he only has a Yeriki left, 28, 21 men, the revolver calf is 15 men, and another Yeriki at 26, and over here he has a saber calf at 21, so only 3 wheel calf units and a skirmish unit with his general, so I don't know if that's enough for all the lines Prussian Prince has left. He still has his general, he has a red bean infantry, Totally full, almost another one, two of them, and a United States Marine 150 range, a white bear infantry, and another red bear. So that makes uh, around five lines, and the general. I don't know. It will be hard uh, for Killerfish to win this. Uh, the Yugi Tai are at 34 men only, so I think one volley and they will be gone. These two spear levy are. No, they're not. They're just making a show off, I think. I don't really know what Killerfish will do at this stage. He's moving his uh, general over forward and his revolver cap, but might get shot by these red bear infantry. Um, he's moving forward over here on the ridge. Uh, the work sh short dojo is in the meantime captured by uh, Prussian Prince. And there's a good uh, position by Prussian Prince over here. He has his red bear infantry covering this flank, and he can always send his United States Marines to over this side too. Uh, to get the sword dojo as some kind of protection. Uh, over here, Killerfish can't really move forward because otherwise he will get shot by the units of Prussian Prince. Yeah, I'm, I will be really interesting if Killerfish is managing to win this. Uh, the, the weakest flank at the moment is over on the left side for Killerfish, so if Prussian, if Killer, uh, um, if I'm sorry, I'm saying it wrong. Uh, the, the weakest point of uh, of uh, Prussian Prince's army is at this stage, this these two units because they're isolated, uh, and I, that's why you have to attack, in my opinion, as I were a killer fish. Um, especially this red bear infantry, which is now uh, I don't really know what he's doing, but he will get shot by these white bear infantry but he's not really reacting there I think Killerfish makes a micro mistake again uh, these units are not particularly good uh, positioned okay, there's the calf charge from uh, Killerfish into these and they just get one shot off into the saber cavalry there comes another charge by some other Yeriki, and I think the Red Bear should legally win. And there comes a charge of Killerfish, he's sending forward his White Bear, his white bear Infantry, uh, already wavering. These Spear Levy are also wavering. 
Uh, another Spielevy, uh, I don't know, uh, he can now get shot by the United States Marines. The general is here to give some moral support. Still, the Jerichia is alive, he will get, uh, but these right, Red Bear will get a back charge from Killerfish, from Jerichia and the general. Uh, I don't know, he's still at one of the nine men, I don't know if he can waver then, but it's in red moral. Surprisingly, these Spearlevy made it to the line, but they are wavering. Uh, also, these revolver cavalry are wavering. The general is on is shooting, and that makes it almost game. But these red bear are wavering. They're still standing, though. Now, killerfish going for the last row of charge into the white bear infantry. Uh, the general will be away because they will get shot by these bullets. But still, uh, I don't know if uh, Killerfish can win this anymore. So GG by Killerfish and Prussian Prince. And I can say that Prussian Prince won the 16 beta call-out tournament. Uh, congratulations and a very good uh, gameplay by both players. So I will see you all at the results screen. So, Prussian Prince killed Killerfish in a best out of three in two games. Uh, that means that Killerfish is, thro is thrown out of this uh, streak. He has to start all over again. Uh, it wasn't a good streak, but at this time Prussian Prince were just the better uh, in playing the game. He deployed 1800 men, killed 911. Killerfish amazingly deployed only 1200 and killed 1200 as well almost. Let's see the unit statistics. The Shogun and Garden Infantry, Prussian Prince 180, United States Marines 177. Royal Marines 180. Black Tutor's Force, they were just wasted. Uh, Prussian Prince made some huge mistakes in the beginning with his four uh, line infantry. But yeah, everybody makes mistakes after you play a lot, a long, a lot of games. Uh, Killerfish, the Yerikee 184, Yerikee 169, Saber Care 168, very good uh, gameplay, even his Yugi tie 65. Although his Revolver Care 0 kills, that's a waste, that's a really waste of 0 kill. Well, that's 1000 coke you wasted, so you can even better take a million birds for, for that money. So, alright, thank you all for watching. Uh, do, uh, don't forget to check out the next beta 400 anniversary tournament. I will put a link in the description box and I will thank you all for watching. So see you later.